One of the hottest fights we have ever witnessed is between Sambo expert Islam Makachev and uncrowned king Charles Oliveira for the vacant UFC lightweight title. It is difficult to dispute Makachev's right to compete for the title. Ten victories in a row are pretty impressive, especially when the majority results from a dominant finish. However, the fact that Makachev has not yet faced a top five opponent causes a lot of speculation. He is leapfrogging a significant number of more competent challengers. Makachev has a chance to defeat Oliveira, which separates him as a true champion, even though he may have made an unforeseen jump. Here is why Makachev is a champion. Charles Oliveira is a fighter who does a lot of damage to his opponents, and this is sometimes delivered in the form of a submission, but that may never work with Islam Makachev. Although Oliveira has a history of putting 14 opponents down in a submission, Islam Makachev is a fighter he will not succeed with. We are now in for an all-out war, but Islam Makachev has the better chance when it comes to submissions. Even the legendary Dubronx who is known for beating opponents into tapping out, that pony trick of his is highly improbable with Islam Makachev. Oliveira has tapped out some great grapplers during his UFC career, including Jim Miller and Kevin Lee. However, it's safe to say he's never matched up against a grappler as skilled as Makachev. More notably, Oliveira's submission attacks usually come during transitions or scrambles, with Dubronx surprising his opponents. That may be difficult, if not impossible, against a suffocating wrestler like Islam Makachev. The Dagestani is undoubtedly capable of bringing down Oliveira, and once in a top position, he's difficult to shake off, even for a submission expert like Dubronx. Islam Makachev's wrestling skills could give him a competitive edge over Charles Oliveira. Charles Oliveira defeated Michael Chandler to win the UFC lightweight title instead of Islam Makachev's mentor and previous champion Khabib Nurmagomedov. Given this, one could argue that Dustin Poirier, not Dubronx, is the best 155-pounder on the planet. The Diamond has defeated Conor McGregor, Max Holloway, and Justin Gagey in recent fights. His brand of pressure boxing and punching power has a good chance of getting him past Oliveira at UFC 269 and claiming the belt. Could Poirier, on the other hand, defeat Islam Makachev? He'd be hopeful, but it seemed improbable given his performance against Makachev's training partner, Khabib Nurmagomedov. Khabib completely neutralized Poirier's notorious pressure boxing, closing him down from the first seconds of the fight and never letting him settle. With the diamond on the back foot, Khabib easily pulled him down and bullied him en route to a third round submission. Could Islam Makachev emulate his mentor's strategy? There's no reason he couldn't. Islam Makachev isn't quite as explosive as Khabib, which means he'd have to tread carefully when closing in on Poirier. However, it is possible that his striking is better than Khabib's, implying that he would not leave himself exposed to counterpunches. However, based on his bout with Khabib, Poirier's Achilles heel may be a fighter who can pressure him back, take him down, and abuse him from the top. Right now, Islam Makachev is the only combatant capable of carrying out that strategy. As a result, it's easy to see a battle between the two going the same way Poirier and Khabib did. Islam Makachev still maintains he is unbeatable heir. Islam Makachev, unlike his coach Khabib Nurmagomedov, is undefeated in the UFC. However, he only has one defeat to his name, and that defeat, a KO at the hands of Adriano Martins, took place so long ago that most fans have forgotten about it. Aside from that loss in October 2015, Makachev has gone undefeated in the octagon, defeating 10 opponents. None of the 10 men ever came near to giving him a genuine fight, even though outs like Drew Dober, Dan Hooker, and Glazon Taibo were completely dominated. Islam Makachev currently believes he is unbeatable. More specifically, the Dagestan native has become more dominant as he has faced stronger opponents. He breezed through his last three opponents, who were undoubtedly the most difficult tests he's ever encountered. Islam Makachev has essentially built an aura of invincibility that is normally reserved for unbeaten UFC champions like Israel Adesanya and Khabib. It's debatable whether Charles Oliveira or Dustin Poirier has the same vibe. Despite the fact that fight happened two years ago, Poirier's defeat to Khabib is still fresh in his mind. Oliveira, on the other hand, has eight losses in the octagon. When it comes to momentum, Islam Makachev appears to be on an unstoppable route to UFC gold. While both Oliveira and Poirier are strong fighters in their own way, they are unlikely to be able to break the Dagestani's aura of invincibility. Do you think Makachev could become one of the greatest fighters in the history of the game? Let us know in the comments, and make sure to subscribe to… for more exciting videos like this.